What's up, friends? All right, so this is the last pour of the evening. Um, I'm about to fly out to Texas tomorrow, and so um, my sponsor list is the same people that I showed you last video and the video before. But um, I do want to just give a shout out to all the people that uh, that have helped support this channel. I really appreciate you all. You all rock my face off. <clears throat> All right, so checked for level on the canvas already. That's good. And um, you know what? I've totally just thought of this. So I've seen other people do this. What about an open top pour? So we'll do a few cups all around and then we'll cover the canvas in white and we'll pour different things in there. And so we'll get little bits of stuff all over. We could do like three off in the corners. And so it'll, right here, we could totally do something like that. Hmm. Huh? I just saw a face. Do you see the face? Eyeball, eyeball, mouth. It's making a funny face. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. Oh man, I love it. <laughs> oh man. It's the it's different size eyes. That's what gets me. He's like, ooh. Anyway. <laughs> oh man. Let's, let's do that. Let's stick with that. Okay, so um, we're going to cover the whole canvas with white. I'm probably going to have to make up more white um, because I don't have enough made up. So, got um, probably like a quarter inch. That's not nearly enough. So, for white, we're using Artist Loft White and or Artist Loft Titanium White. And... We're mixing that with Floetrol and water. I pre-strained my Floetrol earlier. Oh, here, I'll mix this on, mix this on camera. Oh, now he's got a big old giant white head. Ha! Anyway, <laughs> it's terrible. And so, you know, the thing is, is I never really, that's a lot of white. So we're going to have some white on this canvas, just in case you didn't know. All right, so we'll mix this up, test the consistency, because really all we're worried about is consistency here. As long as this, it's got the right, like, honey, warm honey, or you know how warm honey runs off a spoon fast. So if it's like warm honey or um, heavy cream, then you're good. Or no no lighter than heavy cream. But I'm going to make the white a little bit a little bit runnier because I want to encourage fractals. And I want to encourage the white to get up in the business of the other paint. Get all up in its business. So I got my water squirter. All right, all right. We'll check consistency once more before we start dousing the canvas, and then we'll just start covering the whole thing. Oh, that's nice. That's a little thicker. Nah, not nice enough. Just a little bit more water. <laughs> oh, so these things right here, these are just couplers of different sizes. I think that one's two and a half inches. This one is inch and a half. That's an inch coupler. I have another one that's much smaller, um, and I have another one that's much bigger. And I'll use that some other time. But for this time, I thought it would be nice to 
I love that face. Seriously. I can't unsee it now that I see it. Ah, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, man. All right, so... Cover the whole thing with white. Got something on your face there, friend. It's paint. All right, I'm gonna scrape out the last little bit of this. I don't know how much white I need, but I know how much I have. And so that's important to know. I'm just going to use it all. It's my last one for the night anyway, so it's not like I'm wasting paint. I'd be wasting paint if, if I didn't use it all. It sounds so awesome. Ching! Alright, I want this to meet right up with the edge of the cup. I want it to help form that seal so it doesn't uh, leak around the edges. Not that I'm sure it would be that big a deal if it did, but that's just what I want. Awesome. And our last one. <laughs> okay, so let's, uh, Let's get down to business. So, um, I think each one of these will be absent one of these colors. So, two reds and two oranges and two violets. So, each one of them will have slightly different composition. Oh no! I dripped. It was rather dramatic. Sorry about that. Very tired. This morning, uh, like an hour before my alarm was going to go off, my mind was like, Good morning! It's time to be awake! And I was like, No. <laughs> Why? Yeah, it was pretty brutal. Anyway. <clears throat> So, all right, so let's do, let's do purple and orange, Joker style. I keep dripping on my canvas, but I kind of like the way the drips look. Maybe sometime I'll just cover the whole thing in white and drip on it. Actually, that's a fantastic idea. Thanks for helping me come up with it. <clears throat> All right, here's our red. Get some of that business in there. Okay, last but not least. Please tell me I'm recording. I don't recall hitting the record button now that I think about it. 
Okay, good. Whew. Had a momentary freak out, guys. Everything's going to be all right. We're recording. Okay, so... I think I might end up taking a straw and f blowing the things out. Or I could do like I am Ann Osborne does. She li drags, lifts, drags, lifts. All right, so let's use a straw to start blowing this stuff around. <clears throat> awesome. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> nothing really here to torch. I just want to make sure there's no bubbles and whatnot. Whoops, I <laughs> got carried away. I like this one right here. I'm gonna turn it a little bit so I can get a better angle on some of this other stuff. Touch my I did. Oh good. I thought I went a little overboard on that one. <laughs> Okay, <clears throat> went overboard there again. <clears throat> and before I ruin it, I'm going to slow down, <clears throat> take a think. This is cool. I like this, how it broke down like that. Um, You know what? I want more white up in this. So I'm going to, I don't, well, I don't know if you can hear that, but that's my dramatic 15 year old just screaming in the background. He probably lost his shoe or something, misplaced a sock. So we've been having electrical problems at my house, <clears throat> and I'm a, um, I don't know, an amateur electrician also, and so I can do some stuff, but not a whole lot. Ooh, 
as soon as I blew hard, of course it blasted the paint away, but I do like how it kind of, I don't know if you can see that, but it made fine, fine, fine lines. Okay, so anyway, here. Okay, I better be done. I'm gonna mess it up. <clears throat> Some really awesome things. And this is the first time I've ever tried this technique, so. Um, I like this business right here. I think that's insanely pretty. And there's too much solid colors here. Don't really like it. Um, okay, let me, let me correct that. Yeah, I don't really like it. <laughs> and then I really love how this turned out. Um, that's awesome. That reminds me of acrylic inks on Yupo. <clears throat> I love how that red just spread out and totally reminds me of a flower now. Okay, so not my most aesthetically pleasing, but it's really got some amazing parts. I'm gonna, no, I'm not gonna dink with it. I was gonna say, you know what, I'm just gonna mess with it and we'll see what comes up. But let's just be honest, it's not getting better. It's not terrible, but we may paint over this one later. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Appreciate y'all and um, I really couldn't do it without you, so. Um, you know what? If you have room on your subscriber list, I'd be honored to be um, amongst the great of the people that you subscribe to. Um, and if you like the videos, go ahead and click that like button. It really helps the channel. All right, guys. Thank you. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.